Yo, what is up people? It is your boy Sneakles right here and I hope you guys had a fantastic day once again. Today, um, back again, of course, on our MK Don's career mode the journey. Um, obviously, in the early stages of the new season, um, we've got obviously the cup to finish off, so yeah, the friendly uh, competition. Um, I think we're against FC Mets next, um, obviously I'll show you in a bit, um, but I just wanted to talk about a few a little bit of news, um, at least a couple of bits anyways. Uh, we sold Koulibaly, our left back, if you remember him. Um, the, uh, I think he's 30 years old. Uh, but we sold him um, for 1.2 million to AZ Alkmaar. Uh, we got given 925,000 uh, to put on a transfer budget, so that's all good. Um, and then we also want to talk about this. Now this is annoying. I wanted to get uh, Tyrell Malaysia. Um, if you'd watched my career mode on FIFA 20, you'd have known Malaysia was my dominant left back. Literally, what a player! Uh, Malaysia is one of the best players I've ever bought, and he turned into literally the best left back in the world, um, in my opinion. Anyways, uh, he was literally a solid player. Um, but he's at Crystal Palace at the moment. Uh, Palace actually bought him a couple of seasons ago, uh, but they've just received an offer of 18.3 million uh, from Getafe uh, for him. And I thought, you know what? I thought, because left back seal position needs a uh, strengthen, I thought I was going to go for him. I thought, you know what, I'm going to do it. And I went to do it. I went to, I, I literally was prepared to pay 20 million. Uh, I've got 35 million, I think, to spend. I was actually prepared to pay 20 million and give him a, a decent wage, at least, you know, decent ish. You know, uh, I don't know what he would have wanted, but yeah, if I could give him a decent wage, you know, and at least as low as I could, brilliant. I went to go do it, but they won 34 and a half million. How does that make sense? So they, <laughs> they, they've received an offer for 18.3 million, it's probably going to be accepted. But then I go in, going in for him and I bidded 20 million and they said that they didn't want that, they wanted 34.5 million. How the hell does that make sense? I couldn't believe it to be fair, but hey, it is what it is. Um, so just going to have to obviously leave that. Um, and we also saw Williams. Uh, George Williams, one of our centre backs, he went to Cincinnati. Uh, for 570,000 pounds, and we got given 400,000 allocated there. So, just a little bit of news, uh, just obviously to talk about uh, before we go into our next game, our first game, obviously, of this video against FC Mets in the knockout stage of the European International Cup. So, yeah, you know, just like I said, wanted to talk about that, and uh, you know, I'll let you guys know, of course, if there's any more, um, any more news on transfers or anything like that, um, you know, and obviously. Yeah, hope that we can buy players if we do, um, and you know, obviously sell players if there's any more. Definitely to sell, um, but other than that, yeah, we'll just see what we can do and go from there. So, FC Mets in this episode as our first game. Let's go do this and hopefully get that win uh, to go through to the next round. Oh, oh good ball! It might be. Oh, it might. Have, oh no, I've not. I thought I might have just bugged that up there but done quite well and get the ball back to Szymanski who scores again um, Szymanski might have to be my main right mid now and um, he's had a really, a really good few games um, not even just in friendlies either he was good towards the end of the season uh, but yeah good ball to uh, Adeyemi there and then yeah, it's a good little simple ball to Szymanski back and to get the 1-0 so yeah it's a good start and that's all good and also just to mention the reason why I got my M, not my MK Dons, but my FIFA shirt on, well, if you just wanted to know, off, it's basically because uh, I've just literally got and watched it. So, <laughs> simple as that. So, for a few videos, I'll probably have this or whatever, just a different top on. So, hope you guys don't mind that. Well, that was a great ball. 2 0, it's not, it's not offside. I, you know what? Actually, I had, this, I had a little feeling it would have been offside at first. Um, I thought it would have been just, just a tiny bit offside. Not much, just a tiny bit. As I played the ball, but Szymanski gets the assist. It's a great delivery, and it's a good header. You know, just, just aims it towards the corner. Two 0 Honestly, we're doing really well. It's only a friendly knockout competition, but you know, doing really well. Come on, you know, we're just playing good football, man. And Padu, and Padu makes it three 0 What a header! He starts today for my captain, uh, believe it or not, Cargill. Um, if that's how you pronounce it. Um, yeah, I thought I'd give to the game today. I might actually make him a regular start. He's got a little bit better stats than Cargill. Even though Cargill's my captain, 
um, but I think Ampadu would be decent to probably start playing, really. Um, if I give him more games, he'll get better, I guess. So um, maybe he might do that, I don't know. Um, but yeah, awesome stuff. 3 0. Oh, this is. Wow. Great football. Honestly, 4 0. And we are playing fantastic, like brilliant, brilliant, brilliant football. And that just sums up the first half and just gen in general how we've been playing at least the last two videos at least honestly the well, football has been at here, outstanding you know, astonishing football just it might seem simple to some people but that's that's good from Don man target, that's brilliant um, yeah it's not much else there it's a great team up between uh, Boateng and Adeyemi and there you go it is 4-0 just before half time I knew I'd play over there oh Oh, he saved it as well. Oh, it's unfortunate. Yeah, the ball that went over. I knew the ball was going to go over there. I knew it. There was a lot of space. Kuto left a load of space. I'm not really sure why he done that. But hey, it's a typical goal. Um, I tried. I, I kept my shape in most ways. It was just that bit. Um, I got back. You know, tried to defend it. It's a good save, to be honest. But it's just... Yeah, just just a little bit got out of his hands. Um, I mean, this keeper like he makes better saves than Nicole's. To be fair, that's why I keep him in. Um, keeping keeper. Yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, four one. You know, it is what it is. So. Oh, it's a great ball for North. Five one, brilliant stuff. Good boy from Borges there down that left side. And there you go. North comes on. Adiimi to score a goal and you know, to bury the game even more even when they scored that goal uh, Mets, you know, the game's practically over we've honestly been very dominant great football and you know, it's a great lesson for my youngsters as well um, but yeah, just other than that you know, I can't really be any more thankful than the players so far so good stuff 5-1 oh North yes 6-1 my new signing Woodburn done really well there um, to actually get that just to sort of work it into him and North gets his second goal coming on honestly what a game what a game as you see here Woodburn new centre attacking midfielder he is but I'm going to try and change the position to centre mid because uh, I don't actually have a cam uh, roll um, obviously on my formation um, I'm going to need to put him centre mid but yeah brilliant stuff in 6-1 nice semi-final has been done we are through to the final for the first time in this competition and uh, yeah, we have played honestly some brilliant football in our group stage games and this first knockout stage game uh, in the semi final against Mets. 6 1. Honestly, what a result. North comes on scores twice in only four shots he had. And uh, just shows what a good striker he is. Um, but yeah, brilliant stuff, honestly. Brilliant stuff. 6 1. Couldn't be any more proud of my boys. Okay, so after a fantastic victory, 6 1 to be precise, <laughs> uh, over uh, FC Mets. Uh, to go through to the final against Stadi Reims, we do have in that final. Um, you know, it was a great game. Honestly, it was a brilliant game. I keep saying it. Um, but yeah, so on to, like I said, the final. Let's hopefully win our first bit of silverware uh, for MK Dons. It'd be brilliant if we do. If we don't, we don't. It is what it is. Uh, but let's go do this and hopefully we can. So come on. Excellent vision. Oh, go on, It's a great ball through to him. And it's a great goal. It is 1 0. We probably, being honest, don't deserve it. Um, obviously, like I said, and I always say, I don't show you everything. And to be honest, I, I do think um, Steady Rooms have been a little bit of a better, play, um, better team. Um, they've had more chances. They've had at least three or four more chances, honestly. They've, had, they've created chances anyway. Um, and that's probably our first real attack. Um, I think it's at least our first, maybe second shot of the game. Uh, not great, but. So it's a slow start from us, but we've got the lead. So. It's all that matters, and hopefully we can keep it or extend it. Oh, you... No. Oh. How's that penalty, man? He got around me quite well, but I don't get how it's a penalty. I genuinely don't get how things like that are penalties. I really don't. What has actually happened? That. That's not a penalty, is it? It's not a penalty, no. I'd argue with anyone. It's not a penalty. <laughs> Not a penalty, but okay. Uh, oh, oh, it's just gone in. I was actually going to go that way. I know I said that a lot, but 
Unfortunate, man. Really unfortunate to concede. They deserve the goal, to be honest. That's the only reason why I'd let them have that. But, yeah. Okay. Guessing forward. Oh, go on, Grand Jean. That's it. Boateng for 2 1. Oh, I've hit the post. Yep, I backed it at the woodwork, didn't I? If we lose this on penalties, it'd be quite a shame, really, because I think we deserve to take. The way we've played all competition have been brilliant. But Stadi the Reams, that's, that's how you say it. Um, yeah, they've been. They were good. They honestly were. They deserve it if they did win it as well. Uh, I think the circumstances, no. The goal they got is not a penalty. It's not a penalty. So, uh, quite unfortunate. But yeah, so um, as you see their stats, they've been the better team in terms of possession, but other than that, we've tried what we could, so penalties, it is, let's see what we can do, so yeah, um, alright, Szymanski, I aim for the corner, but it goes well, down the middle more than the bloody down. corner, yes, good save, it's the first save, come on, I'm going to go in this corner again. I had a feeling at the post there. I had a feeling it did. Come on. Oh, they've missed as well. Jesus Christ. Kuto. Missed as well. Wow. Interesting penalty kind of shootout so far. Oh, I died really early there, actually. I didn't mean to. <laughs> they scored it. Oh. Come on. Come for arrow. Yes. I expect you to score yours. And the penalty it here. Okay. Well that's ours a practice so far. Put in that corner. Yes, well done Borges. Nice comfortable penalty there. If we save this, we are through. Or if they miss in general. Come on. Oh, you bastard. Well, professional job. Well done. Yes. Good penalty. One well on boating. Smooth in the corner there. Come on. Well, hey, what an awful penalty. It's actually an awful dive as well. I didn't mean to dive that late, actually. Uh, but I went the right way in most ways. And they've obviously skied it. And there you go. We've got... The trophy through penalties, it probably shouldn't be through penalties, but it's actually an awful penalty. I mean, I can imagine that in real life. He's literally lift, it's like he's crossed it. It's more of a cross than a penalty. <laughs> but yeah, brilliant stuff. We get, excuse me, the title. We win the cup, and that is awesome. Honestly, awesome. Um, and honestly, I think we deserve it. But at the same time, you know, I think they deserve something, you know, I'm, I'm, this, this is the thing, I'm going to be honest with you, and I feel like they did do well, and they deserve their goal, let's put it that way, I think it should have been 2-1, at least 2-1, North did have a chance towards the end to finish, but scuffed a, 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 a head off, which he's literally an, a, an absolute G at doing, so I don't know how he missed it, but as you see, if we win our first cup, my first cup as MK Don's manager for 21 FIFA 21, so yeah, it's, a, it's only a friendly cup, but it's still a start or something, so get in there. Okay, so we are going to go into our first game of the championship season uh, for the second season now. Um, obviously, it was in the League One in the first season. Then, obviously, um, yeah, in the championship uh, for the second season, and then now we are up against Reading to start off the third season, uh, so the second season, like I said in the championship uh, to get us off and going. So hopefully we can get three points. Reading ain't going to be an easy game, of course. So I don't expect um, a big result really in this. Um, but yeah, so hopefully we can, like I said, win this. Let's get off to a good start and hopefully get those three points in the bag. So after a good trophy victory as well. Um, so getting a, our first trophy uh, of the season. And obviously as an MK Don's manager in FIFA 21, uh, I want to start off on a good, good foot in the uh, championship. So hopefully we can. But let's see what we can do. Oh. Oh. <sighs> my bad. That's when I say my bad, it's really actually pissed me off. That <laughs> I didn't see. I didn't see that last player coming. I honestly didn't. I've done away my defences. To be fair, 
I didn't see where's my left back just hasn't I've slid obviously but I, d I thought I had more at least extra player having that guy but I don't know oh, it's an awful start 1-0 Redham 1-0 come on Adeyemi take your time oh my god I've equalised, obviously. Yeah, it doesn't look like I'm bloody happy, but no, I'm not. I'm not happy with the way that happened. There, I could have lost that ball. Like I've said it before, do I need a new controller or something? Because why the late, the late, late? I didn't know. I didn't want to do it that late. Obviously, I ran into the box to score, but Christ, look, I didn't tap it that hard. Oh. Everything about it is just like how you know, sort of lucky, really, but you know, deserved to score. But Jesus Christ. Take a, talk about time, literally. But yeah, one one man. Oh, man Jesus. Oh god, Adiyemi, his pace is incredible. He's in the same position again, he's done it again. Wow. Adiyemi has turned this game around for us. We are in the lead for the first time this game. And fully deserved. Unbelievable. Unbelievable scenes. And uh good run from Ferreira as well in that little midfield part. Um and then just just was well, a simple ball to Adeyemi and Adeyemi's pace just literally gets away from the defence and then just slot it in. 2-1, come on. Great tackle. Come on. Simanski, Adeyemi, 3-1 for a hat-trick. What a first game of the season to Adeyemi as he gets off on the score sheet with three goals, making it a hat-trick in his first Championship game of the season. Brilliant stuff from Szymanski down there. Uh, great tackle from Makiki. If I, if I showed you that, if I, if I went that far back, what a slight tackle. Gets the ball, wins it back. Ferreira has it, plays it down to the right side to Szymanski, and then a just simple ball through um, to Adiyemi. And there you go, three one. Oh, blow the whistle right when I'm on that break. <laughs> All right, it is a victory. It's a start of the season with a hat trick as well from Adiyemi. And there you go, it is a 3-1 victory over Reading after a slow start as well. Um, going one them down, yeah, a bit unfortunate, but hey. Uh, but yeah, 3-1, three, 3 points in the bag, couldn't ask for any more. Okay, so you know what, I'm going to end that video there. So we're only doing three games in this video, just like we did in the last one. Um, but of course, of course from, from the next video, hopefully we'll start from doing four games again. Because it's just the start of the season, I've been doing transfers as well and stuff, so... Yeah, it's just I know just three games for now, um, but yeah, good games though. We've got all three victories, which is awesome. Uh, of course, dominating the semi-final by winning six goals to one, um, and then we dominated. Well, we done all right in the final, but you know, you know, we kind of got away. But let's put it that way. Um, yeah, I th I think we should have won two one in my opinion, but you know, it is what it is. Uh, but one penalty in the end, and we got obviously the first trophy. Uh, for us in in this uh, in this series, so it's all good. You know, it's a good start uh, to this campaign. So you know, brilliant. Um, and not only that, uh, we beat Red and three one to date the first set of points of the season as well. So again, great start to the championship. So I can't be uh, any more uh, uh, pleased with that, to be honest. Um, but we're against Brentford next, who sits second at the moment. So they got off to a good start of a win as well. Uh, they're not going to be that easy. Um, but yeah, so we'll. Hopefully see what happens in the next video uh, when we take on them. So yeah, um, like I said, Brentford in our next video uh, to start off with. So hope you guys, of course, enjoyed this video. Of course, leave a like and subscribe. Be much appreciated. I'll see you guys in the next episode of our MK Don's Thieves 21 journey. Take care and peace.